come to our final quick fire round call. Scenes we'd like to see. It's for everyone, so if you could make your way over to the performance area, please. I call ideas for scenarios we'd love to see, and the performers come in with their suggestions, okay? Here we go. <laughs> the first subject is, what a news reporter would never say. Next on News 24, I'm going to punch a zebra. <laughs> Who cares? No one's watching. <laughs> Here, children as young as eight are forced to earn their own living. More polish! More polish! I want to see my face! <laughs> Here on the streets, it seems that Britain is completely in the grip of gang culture. This is John Simpson for the ITN Massive! <laughs> Can you hear the bombs falling? No? That's because they're in Baghdad. I'm here in Peckham. <laughs> <laughs> Reports of a mystery man loitering in the area turned out to be me. <laughs> <laughs> News just then. Go to a break. Your wife's been hit by a truck. <laughs> And it was just a few feet from here that the shots were fired. I know, I fired them. <laughs> well, finally, the power in Beirut seems to be back on. The radiator I'm chained to is getting quite warm. <laughs> <laughs> Even amidst the devastation of this earthquake, there are still stories of hope. I found a man's wallet. <laughs> I am actually in my bedroom, but I'm trying to make it look like I'm in Baghdad on a satellite phone. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't help thinking that if my country was gripped by famine, I'd just move. <laughs> <laughs> the next topic is unlikely letters to be read out on points of view. Why, oh, why, oh, why is the structure of my chromosomes? <laughs> Dear BBC, I watched a light entertainment programme on your network the other night that wasn't hosted by Graham Norton. Is he ill? <laughs> Dear BBC, how did you manage to get those hippos to swim in a circle? <laughs> Dear BBC, I am a Nigerian general with £30 million to put in your bank account. <laughs> Last night, I turned on to your new porn channel, Sea <laughs> <See> Boobies. <laughs> Dear points of your, I would like to complain about the weird voice you are reading out my letter in. <laughs> Dear point of view, has anyone else noticed the Pat Butcher looks a lot like the honey monster from the Sugar Puff family? <laughs> <laughs> Dear BBC, when are you going to show Nuts on the Road? <laughs> mim, mim, mim. <laughs> Dear points of view, I watched Silent Witness with the sound off and it didn't make any sense. <laughs> <laughs> Dear BBC, well, it's now 30 years down the line and I'm no closer to owning a robotic housemaid. Tomorrow's world's tomorrow's horseshit, more like. <laughs> the other night, I watched Nigella Lawson and picked up a couple of good tips on baking bread. And in the process, I just about ripped my cock off. 